What's up, you crazy YouTubers? This is Mike from the Autograph Network, aka The Godfather, coming to you with a whore package mail day here on Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to everyone who is seeing someone, and if you're single, happy Thursday. Um, pretty awesome stuff, guys. Actually, pretty amazing stuff. Uh, I'll get right into that. Um, first, big 8x10 envelope. I do have some 8x10s floating out there, but this is not one of them. So this is a kind of a random thing that was sent to me. Uh, because this guy actually signed my 4x6 photos probably a month, maybe two months ago. Uh, but this is New York Rangers great uh, goaltender, Gals Villemiak. And it's inscribed there to Michael. And this is um, bigger than a 5x7, but smaller than an 8x10. It's like a custom card. It has the stats on the back, but like I said, he sent my 4x6 photos and randomly sent this to me. So hey, I will always take an extra bonus. Um, next one, of course, no postmark, barcoded. But if you guys heard the theme music tonight, I got a Star Wars return. And you guys know I've got two more autographs, so if I'm showing the Star Wars stuff now, i got some pretty awesome stuff. But this is uh, Lauren Peterson. He's a sculptor. Worked on the Star Wars movies. There he is with the sand crawler. Sculptor, modeler. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, wrote a book called Sculpting a Galaxy. And he signed it down there. Kind of hard to see, but still awesome. And of course, like many other people in the Star Wars movies, they pulled double duty, so he played one of the guards there. You guys might remember that shot from the first Star Wars movie. That turned out awesome, so very cool. Always nice to get Star Wars stuff back. Uh, one of my favorite movies as a kid. Um, this one, awesome. Uh, this is JFK related, so piece of history here. This is uh, Temple Bao. Bowley, and here he is receiving a uh, medal certificate from the Dallas Police Department. And if you guys don't know who uh, Temple is, he was the citizen who alerted Dallas Police that uh, Officer J.D. Tippett up here was shot by Lee Harvey Oswald. So, pretty awesome. Here, here he is, a little custom I made. That's exactly what it says, and that's actually the spot where. Officer Tippett was shot and killed. So he signed that and he signed shot of the Dallas police car, which I believe that was uh, JD Tippett's car. So that's from the Warren Commission. So awesome. Anytime I can get JFK stuff, uh, especially anybody that's still alive associated with the assassination, that's awesome. And I got one more. Big envelope, lots of stamps. That means something heavy. Now, I'm not a book person. Um, no offense to anybody that collects books or signed books. I just, you know, don't have the room for them. Uh, I like my photos, but sometimes that's the only way to get somebody. That's the only thing they'll sign, and that's the same with this person. God bless him. He is 96 years old. Probably one of the most iconic film people still alive. Kirk Douglas, my stroke of luck. And it is not only signed, but inscribed to Archer. How awesome is that? Picked up this book on either Amazon or eBay for like a dollar. Uh, a couple bucks shipped to me, and one, two, three, four, five, six, plus they added a 94 cent stamp, so cost me a little bit to ship it there and back, but well worth it. He only signs his books, he's hit or miss, won't sign photos, but sent him, sent him the book and he signed it. An absolute legend, again, 96 years old. Bless his heart for signing. Anyways, awesome day. Kirk Douglas, JFK related, uh, Star Wars, and a bonus. Awesome. So anyways, uh, happy Valentine's Day. Uh, I got my special Valentine. She knows who she is. Anyways, now you know Mike from the Autograph Network. Oh.